All right, in this third video, we are going to take a look at, can you hear it? Check, yeah, all right. In this third video, we are going to take a look at the difference between audio and MIDI. Uh, we're gonna take a look at the shortcuts to create audio and MIDI tracks. And then we're just gonna learn some of the key fundamental differences. So I'm gonna start off by looking at an audio track. This is a track that I've drug and dropped into Ableton Live, um, which is a nice feature. It's just an MP3 of something that I wrote. And as you can see, this is an audio track. We have sound waves. I can zoom in here and you can see the actual sound waves, the compressions and rare fractions. So basically a sound wave is like this, right? You can see this. Uh, my voice talking is a sound wave. And that is an example of an audio track. Another example is if I was going to play an instrument or record a guitar, that would take an audio track. So in Ableton Live, I have this audio track right here. The shortcut to create an audio track is Command T. So there we go. I have an audio track that we've just created. Now, I'm going to show you guys just a little bit about MIDI. MIDI stands for Musical Instrument Digital Interface. And MIDI is how we use Ableton Live's built-in sounds. So we have these MIDI tracks right here. It's important to understand that MIDI does not make sound on its own. MIDI is information. It's basically data. And we manipulate and input that data, and then we assign a sound to it, almost like an application. Um, so right now, I have a MIDI clip. In Ableton Live, when you are in a track, I can make a MIDI clip just by double clicking, and I get a blank MIDI clip. I'm just going to delete this one. So right now, as you can see on what is called the piano roll, which is basically just a piano here, I have played a G four times. Now, if I play this back, I cannot hear it. That is because I do not have an instrument assigned to that MIDI track yet. But on this lesson, again, I just want you guys to understand a little bit of the difference between audio tracks we have here, sound waves, MIDI tracks, data. The shortcut for creating a MIDI track is Command Shift T, and we get a MIDI track. Again, for audio track, that is Command T. Or you can simply go up to Create, and we have this, Insert Audio Track, Insert MIDI Track. So there you are. 